Hello, my name is Martyr, and welcome to the episode of Let's Play Starbound, and thank you for watching. Last time, guys, well, I did some interesting stuff off camera, guys. Remember those items we had in our bag, these little sapling things? Well, I decided to plant a bunch of them, and apparently they kind of all sprung up, and it looks like about a day's worth of time. Which is why they're all chaotic looking and all close to each other. So we're actually gonna... There is a way to basically kind of have a renewable resource as far as trees goes. I've also, you know, got my axe here, which uh, I remember now that it's just so much faster for taking down trees. Uh, and we're gonna just, you know, we're gonna, you know, mow some of these trees down, maybe replant some. And it's just a really good way of just kind of just re-gaining uh, resources, as it were. Uh, because I do believe wood is one of the many things that you can put in your furnace, I think, to power your ship. Um, which will allow us to kind of bounce around the galaxy and hopefully find exotic planets and exotic animals and exotic things and look for items and treasure and all that good stuff. There's plenty of wood right there. Uh, but yeah, basically we planted some of that. Um, and I also went exploring once again, much to my chagrin, and um, I basically, um, let's just, we're just gonna go, it doesn't have to be pretty, it just has to be, you know, on the, in the ground, okay? Okay, there we go, come on, ah, yes, yes, there we go. Good, 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 good. I just need to get rid of all these, to be honest with you. Um, and it seems like every time I go right, um, I always find treasure chests. I actually found one more treasure chest um, to the right, and actually had an interesting item in it. It had a wizard's robe, which I don't really know what that provides for us, um, but it's kind of cool looking. You know, we could add it as kind of like a visual item, and it gives us a little bit of a different look, and I kind of enjoy that. Uh, these will all plant basically very quickly, as you can imagine, by the way. Uh, so yeah, I'm thinking for this episode, we're just we're gonna explore this plant surface. There is something going on really far to the right. I've also managed to mine up some uh, plant vines, so now we have bandages. If we do get too injured, I also created a constr I constructed my iron bow finally, um, and basically at this point we're just kind of um, oh god sakes no get away. Why do I suck with the bow? We've got to practice with the bow more. We just gotta get better with it. We really gotta get better with it. Okay, come on. I am Hawkeye. I am one of the Avengers. Okay, hold on. Our energy's low, that's what's going on here. There we go. Uh, the reason we want to get better with the bow, by the way, if you're wondering, is because um, we get stuff for, you know... Oh, hello. <laughs> Oh my, I must have missed this somehow. I don't know how the hell I missed this. Uh, this is a large vein here. I'm not going to ignore this. Uh, but basically, we just need to get better with the bow because, you know, they drop tasty things like meat and leather, which we can, of course, form into, you know, winter gear um, or um, uh, a meat we can use, of course, to eat uh, because apparently we're a robot that loves uh, steak. I don't know why. It's just... You know, we could be a vegetarian, I guess, if we really wanted to be, but um, I'm not going to go crops. I have decided that chances are I'm going to make a house, and I already have kind of an idea of where it's going to be. Uh, unfortunately, it's rather far away from the starting area, um, but I, you know, that's okay. I think it's over here, actually. Is this where I wanted to do it? Stay away from me already! Okay. Yeah, I think it was right here where I wanted to do this. Now, the reason I chose this particular area... Actually, do I want to go down here and do it? You know, I think this is a much better area. Oh, yeah! We got that guy. Okay. The reason we're going to make a little house over here uh, is it's, it's like really kind of encapsulated in a snow-esque area. Uh, so I'm actually going to construct a uh, little uh, snow house. Let's see if we can do that really quickly. Let's uh, grab all of our snow and slush. Uh, steak can move back into our bags. We have a bunch of crap in our bags, which we need to uh, uh, organize. I'll do that basically next episode for sure. And we're going to go ahead and put all this stuff down. We're going to use this as kind of the base. Or, dang, you're stupid. Okay. We're going to kind of use this just kind of as uh, the base here. The background, as it were. Just make a little quick snowman house here. Yeah, look at that. Look, looks cute, right? Alright, perfect. And then we'll just fill that all in with, you know, background snow here. 
There we go. Perfect. Not exactly, but you know, <laughs> it gets the job done. Um, actually, no, we could probably do a little bit better job than this. This is sloppy. Okay, hold on. Okay. We're gonna just make a little snow house. That's what we're just kind of doing. We're just trying to make a little snow house. All right, we're gonna make a little snow house. I can do better than this. It doesn't necessarily have to be pretty right away. It just needs to be functional. Um, uh, and trust me, my houses in the future will be much better than this crap. But oh, that was a torch. I didn't mean to put a torch there. I'm gonna do that. Okay. Ah, okay. We're gonna do. Okay, we're gonna want to do this. I think with the uh, the the thing here. Okay, that's where I wanted. Like kind of like a floor. Uh, I need to even this out. Fill in these holes. Cool. Okay. Take some layers off. There we go. Okay. Yes. No. Yes. Cool. Yes. Okay. Yes. No. Gosh dang it. Okay. And we'll just fill that out again with uh, whatever holes we made, basically, with some snow here. Um, perfect. And then... Perfect. Now, we can, of course, make a door, which we're going to go ahead and do. And we'll also fill out the background with some snow here. We'll just... Shh. It's a snow house. Okay. It's snowy. It's supposed to keep us warm. It's like an igloo. It's an igloo. It's so dark in here. And this will also give us a safe place to go uh, when it becomes night. Oh my god, I'm really cold. Am I cold? You know, I did surround myself in snow. I mean, it makes sense that I'm cold, but... Okay, so we're gonna... We're gonna... We're gonna... Just tap any tap. Tap any tap. Okay. And then this one can go completely bye bye. Okay. Because the door needs to be about that long. Yeah, okay. Good, good, good. Now can we... We'll craft the crafting table, put it in here. Oh crap, it's starting to become night. That's not good. That's not good at all. I'll craft a wooden door. Fantastic. We'll put the door down. Good. Alright. We got a place. We got like a little hangout as it were. We're gonna make some torches. We're gonna make the maximum amount of torches. We need like a shitload of torches to be honest with you. Uh, especially saying we're gonna start spelunking uh, downwards as it were. You know, I kind of... <laughs> The anal part of me is like, really wants to fix this. I don't know why. It's like, it really wants to make this house somewhat even. Or at least on the top here. So there we go, we got Casa House, Snow, Snow House. Uh, we'll, we'll add some stuff to it, we'll put a bed in here. Uh, and this will basically just be kind of like, just a, a waypoint. That's a chair. Not exactly what I was looking for, but uh, sure, what the hell, why not? Now we can sit down and craft stuff. Uh, but not exactly what I was looking for. We're looking for a wooden bed. Uh, you know what we're going to want to fill in this floor here? Make the floor even, for God's sakes, right? There we go. Okay. And maybe we'll actually raise the roof a little bit. There we go. And then we'll make it uh, an even layer here. That's okay. That's dope. There we go. Perfect. All right. I'll fill in the background. Cool. There we go. We got a house now, guys. It's square. It's kind of lame looking. It's made out of snow. I mean, you can't get any more temporary structure than this. Um, but, you know, it works. It'll be functional. It's an igloo. It's cute. Maybe we should fill in the top with like a bunch of snow and make it more igloo-y looking. I don't know. We'll decorate it later. For now, it's just meant to be functional. We'll we'll get more into it as we get deeper into the area here. Let's get a quick snoo, get one hit point back. Fantastic. And now we have like a base of, of uh, a landing point as we're. We're going to leave that there. And like I said, every time I keep heading this way, this could be my mining area, which, why, which is why I set up that house, by the way, in case you're wondering. Um, ow, 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 ow. There you go. Perfect. My temperature is rapidly dropping, also. Uh, what I was saying was, is, uh, the reason I set the house up over there, our igloo, uh, is it gives us a... Um... Ugh! Die! Okay, cool. It gives us a... Um... Oh my god, I'm out of energy. Out of energy! 
I hate the monsters at night, man. They're really just so ridiculously tough. And this pink glow is just... It's like a towel all of a sudden. Okay, these guys don't want to kill me. That guy shoots freaking fire, by the way. Yes, he is a flame-breathing bird. You got that right. As if you could not get any more weirder, right? I don't know what kind of bird that is. Or from what bowels of hell it comes from. We're going to ignore these guys, but all possible. This is what I'm talking about. Every time I just start heading this way... This is where I had a problem last time. That guy just helped me out, actually. Thank you, stupid creature. Dear God! You are one persistent son of a bitch. Okay, yes, you're dead now. Bye-bye. Okay. What was I saying? Every time we head this way, it seems like there's always just some stuff around here. And I was, I feel like there might be like a, a dungeon or something like really exciting in this general direction. Uh, which is why I feel like we should explore this way. But it seems like every time I go this way, whoa. A rickety smacker. Interesting. I did not see this last time. Okay, we're gonna grab this. I'm also gonna put a torch down really quick. I wanna see something. Uh, torch? Torch? Okay, there's just a little bit of iron around us. Really not, nothing worth gathering right now. I'll gather that later. Okay. I just feel like, to be honest, there's something on this planet. I feel like there's something hidden away from me. Something I don't see. Something that... It seems like there's just something going on in this general direction. And I wanted to build a house... Uh, in this episode, and then uh, look over here, basically. As you can see, the snow kind of extends far out. This is actually where I died. This is where I found that robe. Uh, which we're going to go ahead and take. There's more carrots? Oh, no. Kiwi. Kiwi. Alright. I'm not exactly sure what all those different kinds of fruits and all that does for you. But it seems like we're finding a lot of bit of them. This is actually the farthest I've ever gotten. Like I said, these guys always seem to kick my ass. But even with the bandages, I kind of got my ass kicked off down here this way. Uh, we got some metal there, which will is actually a really deep mine. You know, we're actually going to go ahead and really quickly. And we're going to go ahead and uh, mine the crap out of that because it's just too close to the surface. Stupid me. That was dumb of me to mine my torch up like that. That's okay, though. This is why I love snow, guys. It's just so quick to mine up. There we go. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to just keep going this way. There has to be something this way. No one. I can feel it. Now, one thing you can do is... One thing about Starbound is very interesting about as far as the game goes. Is it's definitely a game that you can just kind of just explore forever. Ugh. Ow. We're going to pop bandage really quick. Okay, that's good. I know I ran away like a coward, but those guys were kind of kicking my ass. Uh, I feel like we might be missing something. Did we miss anything over here? No. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Um, and yeah, basically we're just trying to uh, just see if there's anything interesting going on in this planet, guys. I feel like there's something mysterious. We have a, we have a tree farm, so we don't need to go that far for trees now from the spawn point. I have a mining site set up. Uh, and we'll be more than ready probably here in the next few episodes for the boss. Uh, the first boss, anyways. And then we'll leave the planet, uh, which is, after I get a lot of resources, we'll leave the planet. Uh, and then we'll um, basically head to the next sector, kind of rinse, repeat things, see if we can find an interesting planet to set up shop on, find some valuable resources, and basically kind of just get things going as far as that goes. Uh, I don't, you know what, I guess there really isn't anything in this direction, I should just... I should just give up. There's really nothing in this direction, I don't think. I was wrong. I thought there would be. I just We kept finding interesting stuff. Oh, God! Go away, you flame-breathing bastard! You son of a beach! Go away. Alright, we are kind of hurt, but I think we can take probably one more shot uh, without having to regenerate. There is... Oh, what the hell is this? Okay, I thought there was like something here. It's starting to become day, which is good, which is means hopefully the monsters will chill the frack out. There's another chest. 
I think we're probably gonna... We're probably gonna head back. Useless Bastard Sword. Again, more just chests for us to kind of just take advantage of. of. Um, I don't mind chests. I'll probably put one in my house. Uh, well, we're going to heal. Because these things can hurt you or they can help you. More often than not, they kind of screw you over. What did that do? What did it do? It didn't do anything. What the balls? Die. Okay, I know you're gonna drop down on me when I go for that coal down there. So I'm gonna put a bullet in you. Oh god! Oh, that was beautiful! Okay, you're gonna be a pain in the ass too. Boom! I'd say, getting pretty good with the bow, I think. Maybe. Maybe a little overconfident, I'm not really sure. Uh, we're gonna mine out this cop this coal because we need coal. Coal's always useful. More torches, the more deeper I can go spelunking. The more spelunking, the more valuable materials I can get. And hopefully find more coal. Is that silver or is that iron? Please let that be silver. I think that's silver. Yep. Silver. Sweet! That's good, we need silver. I'm gonna see if I can avoid these guys. We're gonna go a little bit farther than the right, guys, and then we're just gonna. I think we're gonna head back to the ship. Teleport down, check on our tree farm. Uh, make sure that it's growing. Grow oh my goodness, what is this giant mountain? This seems out of place. Did I find something? Oh! My god. Oh! Why? What did I do? What? Why? Why are you attacking me? What did I do? Holy crap! I found civilization and then the first thing it does is attack me. What is up with you, you stupid creature? Get out of the way. Why are they attack me? What did I do? Oh my god, look at all this cool stuff. Oh my god. Look, I didn't mean to start any troubles. Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. okay. Oh my god, they're so tough. Oh god, I didn't mean to start a battle! Okay, wait, you know what? I want all this cool stuff, guys. We're gonna take all these cool decorations. We're gonna make the most pimpin' ship ever. These are such awesome decorations, guys. Look at all this cool stuff, guys. Look, hey, a guy came in here and robbed all of our shit. And I'd be like, yes, that is correct. I want the sword rack. Oh my god, I totally want whatever that is. Want that. Want these. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. This is why I love uh, Starbound, guys. We found some sort of a civilization. And the first thing they did, which, by the way, kind of messed up, was attack me. I don't know what the hell their problem is. Uh, but I'm going to take your fluffy bed here, you sons of bitches. I'm also going to take your cool lights. I'm going to take all your cool shit. Because you started it. I didn't want to fight you. You just, you just attacked me. What is that? Holy buckler. Whoa. Oh, it's like a shield. Okay, we found that. And we got wizard robe of bottoms. So now we're wizardy looking. Okay, they're, they're heading this way. Okay, we better hurry up. I don't know if we're going to... Oh, you know what? I should probably take some bandages. Hold on. All right, hold on. Okay, uh, what does this have? This has curious glitch. Okay, our inventory is officially full of crap. What can we drop? We can't drop anything, can we? Crap. Um. Shit. I should have. I didn't think I was gonna find anything. That's why. Or we're gonna drop this. 
Uh, right, it doesn't work like that. You can't drop stuff in like this game. Uh, we're gonna get rid of. I think is the rickety smacker worse than this? Yeah, the rickety smacker is worse than that. So we'll get rid of that. Okay, that gives us two more sl uh, slots. I want this. And I think I'm gonna grab one of those. Okay, cool. Now we're gonna try. I didn't mean to fight you guys. You are aware of that, right? I like I wanted to come in peace. If at all possible, I would have loved to have come in peace. We didn't have to be enemies, we could have been allies. You know what? I realize now that how that works. I think I know how this works now. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Oh, uh, okay, so we get our weapon is a two-handed weapon. Can we talk? Yes. Yes, let's be friends. Let us work together in harmony. Oh, shit. Please, stop trying to kill me! Okay, well... Uh, there is lots of interesting stuff in this place. Um... I mean, oh my goodness, what is that? Okay, we're gonna we're gonna rob them. I'm sorry. I don't care. For those, a kodo for that oriental sound. Is that a musical instrument? Holy crap! It's a musical instrument. Okay, we're gonna drop these snowballs. We're gonna take this rotten sickle. A rotten tickler. Uh, this episode's definitely gone on long enough, guys. We're gonna um, we're probably gonna explore some more, guys. Um, and then hopefully, I don't want to kill these people. I mean, I want to make peace with them if at all possible. You know, become their friends and live with them in harmony and peace and all that good shit. Uh, but they're kind of jerks. Well, some of them anyways. I don't know. Some of the other ones aren't attacking me as much. Oh, hello. Yeah, so I need this. Thank you. No. Alright. Um, what's that? Flashlight. Green flashlight. Oh, cool. I'll trade my flashlight for this flashlight. Why? Because I like... Oh, look at that! That's kind of cute! I like that. Okay. Um... Uh, yeah, so like I said, we're going to probably end the episode here. I'm actually going to sleep on their beds. Um, as always, guys, tweet me murder agent. We found some people, guys! I mean, yeah, they hate my guts, and they want to see me die. But, you know, they're people! We found civilization! That's freaking cool! That's what I love about Starbound. I didn't expect to see any of this. Oh, we're going to do some mining uh, next episode, for sure. We need to get some materials. We need to get ready to face the first boss. we got a lot of cool stuff to decorate our ship with now, too. Uh, which I really enjoy. I'm probably going to get back here and just rape the crap out of this ship. Um, and basically pimp out my stu my ship and glitch stuff. Uh, but in all, yeah, I mean, a successful episode. I didn't mean to attack the guards. I wish they would have maybe a little bit more friendly to me. Because I had a weapon draw when I first walked up to them. Maybe that's what set them off. I'm thinking it's probably what it was, a rock organ. Oh my god. There is such cool stuff in these chests. What does that do? What? Oh my god. What was that? Okay. As always, tweet me at Martyr HJ, guys. Let me know what you think. And we will see you next time.